Records are being broken here in Corvallis at Oregon State University, not by students, but by that robot named Cassie. Okay, that's not fair to say students aren't behind the success of this bipedal robot that is now in the Guinness Book of World Records because students in the engineering department at OSU developed it. You said set the world record for the uh, fastest 100 meter dash for a bipedal robot in about uh, 24 seconds. Um, which doesn't sound very fast, but it's actually a lot harder than you think it is. What's more impressive about the record, Cassie did this without the use of any arms or eyes. It is just a robot with legs and a small torso, uh, and Cassie's blind. And the idea is to see, can we get Cassie to be as robust as a human at locomoting on two legs. It's controlled by this remote, almost like the remote control cars we played with as kids. So Cassie has uh, no perception above the world around it, and it only gets sort of the commands that we tell it. So like, you know, turn left a little this way, turn right a little this way. They also worked with a company out of Albany called Agility Robotics, who developed a robot called Digit a couple of years ago a robot that's designed to work in a warehouse and perform the repetitive, injury-prone tasks humans eventually won't need to. It's a huge new industry companies are willing to spend a lot on. That's where Alan Fern, professor of computer science and robotics, sees Cassie going. Yeah, I see this going in a number of directions. I mean, research-wise, we want to put uh, eyes on Cassie now and have Cassie be able to do things that require careful planning of your footsteps. Students on this project know that there will be a few missteps in the process. We really like to continue to, you know, push the limits, see what else we can do. Um, you know, we've done some really impressive and exciting stuff so far, like walking upstairs. But they know it'll pay off in the end. In Corvallis, Joe Ranieri, KGW News.